Hey, what's up? Here we go. I went outside and uh, was shooting a video of the sun. And something on the bottom left was interesting. And uh, it came and went. And I'm actually able to see it in the viewfinder for a change. And you can see it's absolutely gorgeous out there. And yeah. Uh, I haven't spotted it yet, but when you see me move in and and the camera begins to get real motionless, you know that I'm on something. There it is on the bottom left. And uh, anyway, as that passes on, something else from the top begins to uh, emerge. And I find it quite interesting. And uh, if you've seen my videos, you know that I have encountered a at least a 40 foot to 30 foot diameter sphere on top of the clouds, bobbing up and down. Uh, that was a little bit after I first moved here in Salt Lake City. And uh, there we go. You see it emerge from the top. And uh, I have been watching these round spheres, clouds, uh, develop ever since. But I've never had a view like this. This is quite amazing. And now, also, if you think about my videos, if you uh, have been following me out, well, what about microbes? Can you imagine these giant spheres? just packed loaded down to the hilt with what microbes that may retain intelligent life even a soul it's it's <laughs> it's very mind-boggling and you know these clouds do this they will compress condense and uh bringing forth what a sphere uh, that appears to just disappear and uh, you know that if it's pulling something in, it's going to be pulling in these dust particles. And uh, that's not going to be a problem. Alright, we're going to have another version here of it. I didn't know I was using so much time, but as, as soon as you slow something down, I, I mean, you know, that's it. Now here, what do we got? The same version again. Well, microbes. I looked them up, and uh, some look like strings. Some look like uh, snakes to a degree. They don't really get real close I guess they don't want to horrify you but there are microbes they're everywhere every type they're in our beds in our body in our skin if filling the air there's just many many type of these microbes and it's nothing new they've been here from the beginning or the dawn of time I guess And uh, I also noticed that there was one microbe that they put out there pretty much, and it reminds me of a Motrin, right, like an Oscar Mayer hot dog. And what I was trying to do is, is identify my microbes. Now, here's an inverted version. I didn't get real big. I just brought it, you know, enlarged it a little bit. I wish I had done it more. Oh well. If I knew that that you guys could enlarge these without me having to go to photo, man, that would save me a lot of hassle. And slowing them down. I know on YouTube, you're if you have an account, you're able to slow them down. I don't know about enlargement, so I know they got the binocular type thing. 
So I thought this was awesome. We don't all, uh, always get a view of an orb being made. Well, a sphere, rather. These are gigantic up there. That's definitely not the size of, uh, what, the head of a pin.